found Jeanette's little sign. Sunday. Yes, I am vlogging today because today is Miss Red the Cyber Nerds March of Dimes walk and I am showing her my love and support. So JJ and I are up early. It is what 8 o'clock. We're supposed to be there by 9 o'clock so we're gonna leave the house pretty soon but I gotta eat my breakfast. I gotta fuel up before I go to the walk. So I am having not the healthiest because I don't really want to eat my um my whatchamacallit, I don't want to make my smoothie because I don't have enough. So I'm having rice, cocoa crispies, some bananas, it's half banana, and flax seeds and also um, almond milk. So that's my breakfast. I'm also going to read, I don't know, I bought this and just something to read like every morning. It's only like, what do you call it? It's only like a page that I have to read. Just kind of like, you know, just food for thoughts like every single morning before like you actually get up and start your day. So this is Joel Austin, Austin, is that how you pronounce it? Your best life begins. Your best life begins each morning. So I thought this would, pre this would be pretty awesome to read every morning as soon as I wake up. So like I said, it's not, it's not a long, like, long thing to read. So it's just like a p one pager. Yeah. So I started this actually, um, it begins May or January 1st. Hold on, let me flip it. Like, yeah, it begins January 1st. But I kind of wanted to start January 1st. But then I'm like, you know what? I'll just do like the actual day. And so right now, May 3rd. And then, you know, start over again next year. So I'm gonna read this while I make my breakfast and then after I read my breakfast or after I read this, not after I read my breakfast, after I read this, then I'm gonna um, quickly do my grocery list. Mama. So my beach body team and I, yes, I said beach body team. I am now a beach body coach. I'm so so excited. And I will tell you more about it as soon as um I get my um my package. My team and I are hosting this 10 day clean eating challenge. So I mean pretty much all you do is you just eat clean for 10 days and it's really not meant for you to starve yourself to death. It's really to help you eat cleaner and healthier and fuel your body with the right nutrients. So. And I am part of that um, challenge too, don't get me wrong. I know I am pregnant, I shouldn't be on a diet or anything. This is not a diet, I mean, once you cleanse your body, it gets rid of all the toxins, the junks that you put in your body. As a result, you lose weight. It's more than a thousand dollars. You are a member of the Circle Champions. Please give yourself a round of applause. Use your arms, buddy. Special t-shirts and Mario Robbies. So I want to thank you all for being here and joining represented by butterflies in the March of Dimes Mission Town. Let's honor these families right now in our hearts with a brief moment of silence right now. Ready to go here. 
For over 75 years, people like you have shown how much they care about babies. What you do to them. Okay, so I put like probably eight uh, Oreo cookies in here, and he ate like the one almost. He ate almost. He almost ate the whole thing. <gasps> You're just chilling. Are you so tired? You're sitting down the whole entire time. I'm the one pushing you. I'm pushing a 35 kid, 35 pound kid, and um, maybe like a 20 pound stroller. <coughs> With a stinky killy killy. Does anybody need to go potty? JJ, finish line. You can make it. Finish it. Finish it, Jay. Wait, hold on. You guys are too fast. JJ, you made it. I just came back from the grocery store, Costco, and Trader Joe's. So I thought I'll show you what I got before I put them away. So Costco, we got eggs, um, organic spring mix, cucumber, strawberries. These are getting expensive. This is like eight something for four pounds, two pounds, two pounds of this or three pounds. I don't know. I, I don't. So this is you know, 64 ounces for eight something dollars. Chicken, roasted chicken for dinner tonight. Um, also for salad for this week. Uh, yogurt, Udi's bread. This is also getting expensive. This is like close to seven bucks, six forty nine, or maybe it's even. Yes, um, I think it's. Is it? I can't remember if it's six dollars or seven forty nine, but expensive this used to be like $6.99 and now it's like oh I think it's $7.49 $7.49 for a loaf of bread and it used to be $6.99 this is on sale uh, for seven bucks so and we are out of semi sweet chocolate chips so I got that and avocado there's six avocados in here for $5.99 and at Trader Joe's I have this is JJ's request gluten free Joe Jojo's, his Oreos, he loves them. Um, shredded three cheese blend, hummus for snacking, milk, and some zucchini. So that is grocery for this week. Okay, I am doing my food prep for the week. And I really suck at making hard boiled eggs because they're either undercooked 
and sometimes they're overcooked so I, I've seen people do them like bake them in the oven so I'm gonna try doing that I have 12 eggs in a muffin pan and it says to bake it at 325 degrees for 25 or 30 minutes so I'm gonna try that and see how that goes and also I don't have to like keep washing the water or whatever like the water boiling so I'm gonna do that and also I'm making my um my oatmeal banana muffin just easy snacking and also I have my strawberry um, washing right now I put lemon oil in here that way it will last for a week I before I like before strawberries would only last like a week for us and since I have so much strawberries I end up like freezing a whole bunch of them but since I started putting lemon oil in the water like the, to wash my um, my strawberries they last like I don't know maybe at least two and a half like the strawberries that I have here in the fridge that I bought probably two weeks ago they're still pretty good I still probably have 12 strawberries left um, and also like grapes they last a very very long time too if I just um, if I just put lemon drop lemon oil if I just put a drop of lemon oil in my water to wash the grapes or any kind of fruit or vegetable they really last for a very long time so that's what I am doing right now like the kitchen is a complete like, mess right now because I'm like I know I have to just like I don't have room for this yet I'm still trying to clean up the fridge I'm still trying to clean out the fridge and then I gotta wash this the grapes that my mom gave me yesterday and then I got the watermelon that she gave me too that I need to cut up and this is watermelon from last week we still need to eat <laughs> we have not had dinner yet it's like 6 30 something but 6 25 but I don't know there's so many things going on in the kitchen but yeah this is prepping for me it's a lot of fun got watermelon sliced up have it in two containers you want more watermelon come here and then i got grapes washed up and strawberries are ready to go i just need to put them in a little container for my snack for tomorrow so i could just grab it and go don't they look so so good they're so colorful especially the red it's so like i don't know i just love the color I just want to put this one in my mouth. Eggs are also done and I don't really want to peel them and check but they look cooked. So we'll just have to see tomorrow when I eat them. But they are done. I got a dozen of eggs here and I just need to put it in some kind of container or something. Okay, I decided to peel them but I'm not really sure what those dots are. I guess that's like part of the burnt part. I have no idea. but. It won't come off but yeah 12 eggs hard-boiled eggs in this little container ready to go for next week or for this week's meal so I could have this either part of my lunch or snack good protein muffins are done and I'm gonna try not to take one because really this is only good for I don't know five days I guess because JD is going to have some too for his breakfast at daycare. So that is that. I um, I just need to wash all these dishes, run the, run the dishwasher. And that is it for the night for me. It's been seriously a long, long, long day and I'm super, super exhausted. So I think I am going to call it a night. It is almost 8 o'clock. Um, calling it a night and I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, also if you guys want to join the 5 or the 10 day clean eating challenge let me know you are always welcome to hop in even though it's late but you know you can still catch up and stuff so let me know comment down below if you want to join um our clean eating diet and or clean eating challenge i don't want to call it a diet because a lot of people say or a lot of people think if you're on a diet you're like starving yourself and like i said earlier i don't know if i did but i'm gonna say it again this is not meant to starve yourself this is to clean um cleaner to eat cleaner this is to eat cleaner eat healthier like feed your body the night the right nutrients so um what else do i have to say so yeah comment down below and i will add you to our group on facebook and yeah it's just you know you like you just have to check in every single day and a lot of the coaches are going to be there coaching you cheering you up motivating you and i am also doing this 
and I am not trying to lose weight. I am pregnant 22 weeks and I'm not trying to lose weight. I just really need to start eating clean. And I mean, I have been eating like, well, at least this weekend, like I just kind of just ate whatever. And and my glucose test is coming up. So I need to start clean, eating cleaner, cleaner. Um, so yeah. Anyways, with that being said, I will see you guys tomorrow. If you guys like this video, give this video a big, big thumbs up. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!